Hello everyone, today we're going to upgrade Windows 7 to Windows 8. Double click on VMware Workstation. So I'm going to be using the clone version of my Windows XP virtual machine. And I used this clone in a previous video to upgrade from Windows Vista all the way to 7. So for this video, I'm going to be using, I'm going to be upgrading from Windows 7 all the way to Windows 8. So I'm going to power on this virtual machine. Give it a few. I'm going to type in my password into 3ABC. Very secretive. Very complex. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click going to settings and then I'm going to CD DVD. I'm going to browse into my secondary hard drive and go into ISOs, client, and Windows 8 Enterprise 32 bit. So I want to keep everything uniform. I'm going to keep everything uh, within this upgrade series all the same. I'm going to keep everything in the 32 bit order. Then click OK. And then go here. Computers, if it doesn't show, if it's not showing up, let me just make sure here, right click. There we go. We have to turn, we have to connect it. Connect. There you go. Let's close this part. Run the setup and click yes. We're going to click on install now. So what we're going to do is, we are not, we're choosing the option not to update. If you, go this, if you choose this option, it's going to update your operating system. So I'm going to click on this one. And accept the license term and click next. I am doing an upgrade. Not a custom. Remember. This will install a new copy of Windows. And also, I did totally forgot. Make sure if you are doing this on a real machine with your real with your real data and all that stuff, be advised to copy over your data onto a onto the cloud, onto a, a secondary hard drive, portable. It doesn't matter anything. You never know what might happen, and then you know might regret losing all your data. So what we're gonna do is um, upgrade, and this will take a few minutes. I will see you at the end of the installation, or excuse me, I will see you at the end of the upgrade. So let's keep it default. I'm gonna leave the color as it is. You could change the color though, whichever colors you like. But I'm just gonna keep it as it is. Click next. I'm gonna be using Express settings, but feel free to use customize, which allows you to customize the settings on your on the operating system. But I'm gonna just use Express settings. And there you go. I'm going to type in my password. One, two, three, A, B, C. This might take maybe like a minute or two. So this is how you upgrade from Windows 7 
to Windows 8. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace.